The second part of the choices paper, I call the vision section. It asks you to take a look at your future, future, imagine your future, about five years from now. The usual context for that is you're a sophomore in college, and you're going to graduate in about two and a half, three years tops, please, right? And you're going to be out of college for maybe a year or two. I'm asking you to envision and imagine how you would like to have your life moving at that time. So I'm going to ask you to describe in very graphic detail, as much as you can, cut out pictures to illustrate. Where do you live? What kind of job do you have? How much money do you make? What kind of car do you drive? How is your apartment or house furnished? Are you in a relationship? Do you have kids? Do you have a pet? How do you spend your free time? What other things are still important to you or new things that have arisen? I want to know where you would like to be in about five years and the lifestyle you can imagine living. And if that means cutting out a picture of the house or the apartment or the, the bedroom and furniture or whatever of where you want to be, that's great. And the car you want to drive, good. Clip a picture out of it. Talk to me about the music you will enjoy then. Will it be different than what you like now? I really want you to imagine just as graphically, as colorfully, as realistically as possible. How do you want your life to be in five years? Now, you may adjust that time frame based on your individual circumstances. But here's the point. You have got to have something to go towards, something to aspire to, something to shoot at if you're ever going to hit it. If I blindfold you, I can outshoot you with any weapon you want. Pistols, rifles, bows and arrows, throwing spears. As long as you're blindfolded, you can't hit a thing. Don't be blindfolded about your future. If you're going to use what you've got to get where you want to go, where do you want to go? Clarify that in your own mind. Remember, this paper is not for me. This paper is to make you go through the choices we all have to make in life. Now, does the vision that you create necessarily lock you into a particular program? No. You can change your mind any time. Is it a guarantee you'll get what you want? No. But at least it gives you a sense of direction, and hopefully it's a motivating factor. You think about the way you want your future to become, and you're more willing to work now to make that happen. That's economics. What are you going to do with what you've got?